here and welcome back to another video. Today I'm off to my friends at Regal Autosport. Now, some of you guys may remember that that is where I got my Miltec catback exhaust fitted a few months ago. Now they have invited me along to check out one of the cars that they've been working on, a Lamborghini Gallardo. So I'm on my way there now as you can probably tell. Uh, I'm going to be there in about half an hour or so. So I'll catch up with you when I arrive. here at Regal for spin round we'll see the dyno room which we will be using at great lengths today uh, please do excuse how dirty my car is the car in question the Lamborghini Gallardo is in the workshop behind me so let's head on in and take a look the loudest cold start I've ever heard in my entire life, I can talk to you a little bit more about this car. This is a 2009 Lamborghini Gallardo LP560-4. However, it's not running 560 brake horsepower like it did when it rolled out of the factory. This thing has got a VF engineering supercharger on it, which means that the power has been boosted all the way up to 700 brake horsepower. Now, technically this should run about 750 brake horsepower, like what VF engineering say when they advertise them but this being a 2009 one, it only reaches 700. However, as you've briefly seen already, it is a bit of a beast and we've hardly even moved it yet. So whilst this thing warms up, let me talk to you a little bit more about what's been done. So because I'm not a mechanic, I've got Ben here to run me through okay. basically what he's done. So, over okay, to you. So here we have this Lamborghini. Um, it's come to us because he had a couple of running issues with the car. Uh, they couldn't seem to get it right on the tuning side of things. So uh, they brought it to us because we've done quite a few of these uh, getting some nice power out of them. So, first thing we've done with this is complete health check, make sure the car was functioning, all the sensors were working right, um, just getting it in a, in a nice state before we started tuning it, really. Um, once we were happy with that, we took out the ECUs, took full backup from all the EC, both ECUs in this car, um, stored them so we had the original files before we started tuning. Um, once we were happy with the files, we started adding some hardware to it. So, the first thing we've done with this is We've done away with the single OEM fuel pump in the tank and we fit a twin billet pump set up. So high flowing pumps to keep the low pressure side of things up. So it's also on a boost switch, which I can show you here. So what we've got here is this little switch. Um, it's plumbed into the boost system. So when that hits its uh, desired boost level, it's gonna kick that second pump in, supplying the pressure from five bar up to seven and a half bar, low profile fuel pressure. So, colossal amount of fuel pressure there to keep up with it. So, uh, so yeah, once we'd done that, um, the next step was to fit the larger maps into this. So, it goes up from the, uh, the stock maps to these bigger ones here. Uh, there's a lot more flow now from the supercharger. So, bigger maps to accommodate with that. Um, and again, with this, we went for a smaller supercharger pulley. So, it takes the stock pressure from six and a half, 0.65 bar up to 0.75 bar. So it's around 16 PSI at the rev limit. So quite a lot of boost going on here. So sounds like an yeah, absolute weapon. That's it. It's just a bit of an animal. Um, no cats in this thing. Yeah, as, we, as we've heard. <laughs> Straight through exhaust. So it's, uh, it's loud as we're here on the dyno later. So mm. yeah. Interesting stuff. Wicked. All sounds very confusing because I don't really know what I'm talking about. But I think all there's left to do now is run the car over there and make some even make some more ridiculous noise. noise. Let's, <laughs> Let's do it. Thing 
thing to do <laughs> is to get some of these. <laughs> for now before my microphone decides to collapse. <laughs> this thing is incredible. Like I said before, I'm not sure how accurate the microphone is going to make up the sound. Um, oh my god, this thing is an absolute weapon. <laughs> anyway, that's all we've got time for in this video, but man, I cannot get over this car. I want a VF supercharged car <laughs> right now. Yeah, big thank you to the guys here at Regal Autosport for making this video possible. It was so cool to come down there and actually witness a car on a dyno because I haven't seen a car on a dyno before. So that was very cool. But yeah, drop a like on the video if you did enjoy and make sure you're subscribed for all the adventures coming soon.